from the deep blue oceans to the lush forests. Planet Earth has been home to some of the largest and most impressive creatures in the history of life. Some of these animals are so massive that it's hard to even imagine their size. From towering herbivores to the fierce predators, these huge creatures have left an indelible mark on the planet. In this video, we'll take a look at some of the largest animals that ever lived on Earth and what the largest is today. From the biggest sauropod dinosaur to the gigantic creatures that prowled in the oceans, get ready to be amazed by the sheer size that these magnificent creatures possessed. Argentinosaurus is a massive herbivorous dinosaur that lived during the late Cretaceous period, approximately 19 million years ago in what is now Argentina. It's known for being one of the largest land animals that ever lived on the planet, with estimates suggesting it may have reached lengths of up to 100 feet and weighed up to 100 tons. Its long neck made up around half its total body length, and it had a relatively small head, with a brain the size of a baseball. The bones of Argentinosaurus are some of the largest ever discovered, with thigh bones measuring over 6 feet long. It was so big that it likely had to eat vast amounts of vegetation just to sustain itself, and it had to eat up to half a ton of food each day. It probably faced very few due predators due to its sheer size and strength. But Argentinosaurus was not the only big dinosaur roaming the planet. Spinosaurus is a genus of theropod dinosaur that also lived during the late Cretaceous period, around 100 to 95 million years ago. It's known for its distinctive cell-like structure on its back, which is formed by elongated spines of vertebrae. The first fossils of Spinosaurus were discovered in Egypt in the early 20th century, but they were destroyed during World War II, however. New fossils have been discovered in recent years, providing more information about this unique and intimidating dinosaur. It turns out that Spinosaurus didn't just hunt on land, and is believed to have been a semi-aquatic dinosaur, and spent a significant amount of time in and around water. Its adaptations for swimming included its long, narrow snout, which may have been used for catching fish, and its webbed feet were able to propel the big scary, shark-toothed beast through water with ease. However, the jury is still on out on just how fast a swimmer Spinosaurus was, and whether it spent all, or just some of its time in water. Spinosaurus was one of the largest carnivorous dinosaurs, with some estimates putting it at over 15 meters in length, and weighed 8 metric tons. It's probably safe to say that this dinosaur was scary at any size and speed. But dinosaurs weren't the only huge animals to live on Earth. Shastasaurus is a prehistoric marine reptile that lived during the late Triassic period, around 210 to 215 million years ago. It's considered one of the largest known marine reptiles to exist on the planet, with some Shastasaurus reaching lengths of up to 20 meters long. Its size is comparable to that of a modern blue whale, making it one the of largest creatures to have ever lived in the oceans. Shastasaurus was a highly adapted swimmer. Its elongated body and paddle-like limbs suggest that it was capable of sustained, efficient swimming its big, oddly shaped tail was likely used for propulsion, similar to that of a modern dolphin. Shastasaurus was a carnivore that probably fed on other marine reptiles and large fish. Its elongated snout, filled with sharp teeth, suggests it was a specialized predator. But there were other specialized predators that would take its place millions of years later, lurking in the deep, always hunting and looking for its next meal. The infamous Megalodon, also known as the Megatooth shark, is one of the most well-known prehistoric sharks that ever lived. This huge shark lived during the Miocene and Pliocene epochs, approximately 23 to 3.6 million years ago, and was one the of the largest predators to ever swim the oceans. The size of megalodon is the most impressive feature of this species. The largest specimens of megalodon found may have reached lengths of around 18 meters long and weighed up to 60 tons. To put this into perspective, the largest known great white shark, which is a close relative of megalodon, only reaches a maximum length of around 6 meters and a weight of just 2.5 tons. One of the reasons for the massive size of megalodon was its diet. 
Scientists believe that these sharks fed on a variety of large marine mammals, including whales. The bite force of megalodon was estimated to be between 10 and 18 tons of pressure, which is more than 10 times the bite force of the largest recorded great white shark. This allowed megalodon to easily bite through the thick blubber of its prey. But despite its impressive size and strength, megalodon went extinct around 3.6 million years ago. However, the exact cause of its extinction is still debated to this day. Some theories suggest that the extinction of the megalodon was due to a decline in the availability of its competition prey. with other predators. It's possible that one of the creatures that likely took over as the ocean's top predator might have been a giant known as Liviatana. This huge prehistoric whale lived approximately 12 to 13 million years during ago during the Miocene epoch. It was one of the largest predatory whales to have ever existed, with estimates suggesting it could also grow up to 17 to 18 meters and length. weighed up to 50 to 60 tons. Liviatan had large, robust jaws with teeth that could grow up to 36 centimeters in length, making them some of the largest teeth of any known carnivorous animal. These teeth were blade-like and serrated, which would have been well-suited for tearing into the flesh of prey. Based on the structure of its teeth, it's believed that Liviatan primarily preyed on large, marine animals such as whales, seals and other dolphins. Given their size and predatory nature, it's possible that Liviatan could have attacked and even killed and eaten a megalodon. However, it's important to note that there's no direct evidence of such an interaction as both species live millions of years apart and in different marine environments. When it comes to huge land animals, not many are aware of this next one. Parasrotherium would have been an intimidating animal to be around, regardless if it was a herbivore or not. They were hornless, rhinoceros-like mammals that lived during the Oligocene Park approximately 34 to 23 million years ago. It's definitely one of the largest land animals that's ever lived, with an estimated weight of up to 18 metric tons, almost as much as three or four adult African elephants, and a height of over 5.5 meters at the shoulder. Parasrotherium had a long, flexible neck and a small head in proportion to its massive body. It's believed to have been a herbivore, feeding on leaves and other vegetation. It had four large legs, each with three toes, which were adapted for supporting its weight and allowing it to move across vast areas. But this wasn't the only giant land animal running around on the planet. There were three other giant animals roaming the land of North America around 23 to 20 million years ago. Erden was one of the largest, and Teledons, a group of pig-like mammals that roams North America and Eurasia. During the Oligocene and Miocene epochs, it stood over two meters tall at the shoulder and weighed up to 498 kilograms. They had done with an omnivore that ate almost anything it could catch or scavenge, including small mammals, reptiles, birds, and carrion. It had a powerful bite force and sharp teeth that could crush bones. But the terra pig, Dearden went extinct during the late Miocene. Around 5 million years ago, possibly due to competition with other carnivores or climate change, Besides from the mammals, there were giant reptiles creeping around that you probably wouldn't want to meet, like this next monster. Megalania, also known as the giant ripper lizard, was a prehistoric predator that lived in Australia during the Pleistocene epoch. It was a massive lizard that's estimated to have grown up to 6 meters long and weighed up to 680 kilograms, making it one of the largest lizards to have ever existed. One of the most interesting things about Megalania is that it was able to climb trees. This is surprising given its large size and heavy body. But it's believed that Megalania used its strong claws to climb up trees to search for prey or escape from predators. Another interesting thing is that thing. Megalania went extinct around 50,000 years ago. This means that it's very possible humans were either hunted or the hunters of Megalania. So far we've covered a few of the biggest animals that are now extinct. But what are the largest animals on the planet today? If you answered whales, then you'd be correct, and you'd get a shiny gold star. When it comes to toothed whales, sperm whales are the largest and can grow up to 18 meters in length and weigh over 60 tons. Sperm whales are known for their remarkable ability to dive to incredible depths of up to 3,000 meters and stay underwater for over an hour.
making them one of the deepest diving mammals in the world. Sperm whales are APX predators and feed primarily on squid, but also eat fish and other marine animals. They're also known for their ability to use echolocation to locate prey in the deep ocean. Now that seems huge, but there is one animal that's much, much bigger, and its immense size and impressive abilities will simply blow your mind. Blue whales are the largest animals to have ever lived on Earth. They can grow up to 30.5 meters in length and weigh up to 200 tons, making them even much larger than any dinosaur that ever lived. Blue whales have a heart the size of a small car, weighing as much as 680 kilograms. A blue whale's heart only beats five to six times per minute, but pumps over 10,000 liters of blood with each beat. Their blue-gray skin pattern is actually made up of millions of tiny organisms called diatoms. And here's something else remarkable we bet you didn't know. Blue whales produce some of the loudest sounds in the animal kingdom, with their calls reaching up to 188 decibels. That's louder than a jet engine. They also have a lifespan of about 80 to 90 years, putting them right up there with humans as the longest living mammals on Earth. Sadly, despite being the largest animal on the planet, blue whales are also one of the most endangered species, with only around 10,000 individuals remaining in the wild. And that's a wrap on the largest animals video. We hope you enjoy learning about these incredible creatures and their impressive sizes. If you found this video informative and entertaining, let us know with a thumbs up and stay tuned here by subscribing to our channel for more fascinating content about planet Earth, the universe, and everything out there in the cosmos.